back to my channel. Why do I always clap in my intros? <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in. Today's video I'm going to be talking all about natural deodorants. So I've been using pretty much regular deodorants all my life, but I began to think and be like, why am I putting deodorants that are so harmful, that have chemicals in them, the ingredients are not safe whatsoever, into where I sweat. Where sweat is coming out, I'm putting in chemicals. Why? Why was I doing that? I don't know. I don't know what was wrong with me. I don't know. If you guys didn't know already, antiperspirant deodorants basically stop you from sweating. So what they do is they block your sweat from releasing, which means your sweat is building up inside your armpits. The toxins aren't being released from your body, so all the toxins that's trying to come out, you're keeping it into your body. Does that not sound harmful to you guys? That, that does not sound good. Like, that's disgusting. Like, it's blocking your pores, it's building up in your system, and then girls specifically wonder why their armpits get um, really dark. So I decided to myself, I want to switch over to natural deodorants, and I wanted something that was going to control my odor, but I didn't want something that was going to block the sweat, because to be honest, I don't really care if I sweat. Sweat is a natural process, sweat is healthy for you, sweat is good, and I really don't care to sweat. Um, if I sweat, I sweat. I just don't want to smell. You know what I mean? So I thought and I was like, hey, natural deodorants will do that. So I came across of Smith's Naturals. They have a few deodorants. Um, I have about three of them. I have a coconut pineapple one. I have a charcoal magnesium one. And I have a rose vanilla one. So I've been trying these out for about a few months now. And I honestly will never go back. Like, I know that's a big statement, but I'm never going back. I am forever a natural deodorant girl. I don't care what anybody says. Ugh, I don't care, okay? They're plant-based. They're mineral-enriched. Um, they have no um, artificial fragrances. They have... What else are they? I swear they're vegan. They're cruelty-free. They're gluten-free. They have no aluminum. Key. Just to give you guys an idea of what ingredients are actually in here, I'm going to read maybe the top four ingredients because as you guys all know, top four ingredients are usually the most portions that are in here. So the top four, one is arrowroot powder, one is baking soda, coconut oil, and shea butter. Those are top four. Then you go on and your um, jojoba seed oil, activated charcoal, vitamin E, sunflower, all that good stuff. Like, so good. They all smell amazing too. They smell so good and they don't smell like a natural boring scent. Ugh, a natural boring scent. They smell like nice scents. So throughout the day when I'm wearing it and I'm smelling it, I feel good. I'm like, yeah, natural deodorant smells amazing. I'm loving it. Now to be very honest, I did notice um, when I was using the charcoal magnesium one, I noticed that right after I shaved, when I would apply this to my underarms, I would get a reaction. I would, it would burn, like, it would really burn and sting and be so irritated. And I did not like that at all. It was really uncomfortable and it just kept stinging and burning and it, like, I would get a little red. It also says a warning on the bottle, do not apply after shaving. So maybe I should have read that first. <laughs> but hey, who reads labels, right? <laughs> And so maybe my underarms are just a little bit um, sensitive because I think it's the baking soda in here that does that. Obviously when your pores are open, it just stings. And so I think I'm just very sensitive to the baking soda. So they did come out with a sensitive skin formula, which is the coconut pineapple one. And when I use this, it doesn't do it at all. So I'm just glad that they have a sensitive formula because in here there's no baking soda. So keep that in mind guys, keep it in mind. Now, I do find with unnatural deodorants like Dove or Lady Speed Stick or whatever deodorants, I realize that usually you could just apply a lot and it's whatever, right? With these deodorants, you can't really apply too much. If you apply too much, then what's going to happen is it, the first layer is going to absorb into your skin and it's going to work and everything, but then you're going to be left with clumps. And I've noticed that I've been, you know, kind of accustomed to 
putting a lot just naturally and yeah I've been getting clumps I've had to figure out how much to put and honestly a little goes a long way you don't need to put a lot another thing you have to keep in mind when you're transitioning from unnatural to natural is how do you apply it so for these specifically you have to apply it like let me show you you have to go like this um, and keep it on like keep it on your skin for a while to warm it up and once it's warmed up then you could do the brushing and it warms up fairly quickly so it's not an issue just a different way of applying it and you have to get used to it if you're going natural right now I've also did a test and tried to work out with it well not a test but like I went through my day and decided to work out for me it um, it really depends on my day to be honest some days I work out with it and it's all good I smell good I'm up at the gym and I'm like Whoo, I don't stink but then other days, it's like, oh, I didn't put as much as I maybe should have. Like, it'll give a little bit of smell, and I'm like, oh, I maybe should have applied a little bit more. As for me, um, I'm still trying to figure out this whole natural deodorant thing. Uh, I think it's going to be worth it once I've mastered how much to put, how little to put. But yeah, I highly recommend you go out and get these little guys. So far, I've heard that this is one of the best natural deodorants. Honestly, my mind's just at ease that... You know, I'm doing the best that I can to stay away from harmful products. And just knowing that I'm not stopping the natural flow of my body. And that's honestly <sighs> relieving. That's, that's actually relieving. I don't know. It makes me feel good. Hey, if I feel good, I feel good. So Another bonus about these is they absorb really quickly into your skin. And they aren't sticky. They aren't, um... Like, to be honest, once it absorbs, I don't, I don't feel nothing. I don't feel like I'm even wearing deodorant. The only time I know I'm wearing deodorant is when I smell them. Like, it just smells so good when I lift up my arm. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I'm never, ever in my life going back to antiperspirant deodorant. I'm sticking with all natural. And I think you guys should too get on it. I'll put um, the link to these products in the description box if you want to try them out, want to do some research on them. They also have natural toothpaste and soaps that I have yet to try. I am really interested in their toothpaste and I do have some of their soaps that I'm going to be trying later on, their bar soaps, which I'm excited about. If you guys do want me to review their natural bar soaps, leave a comment down below and I'll be glad to do that for you guys. Also let me know if you guys have even tried their deodorants and how you guys like them, your experience with it. I'm sure other people watching this video would want to know other people's experiences as well. And I'm also interested just to see, you know, how it's working for everybody. So leave a comment. Hope this video helped you guys out. I'm telling you guys right now, go to natural deodorants, okay? No more antiperspirants. I don't care if you're a guy, if you're a girl, if you're a child, if you're a woman, I don't care what you are. Natural deodorants, okay? They're the key to life. Give this video a thumbs up if it helped you guys out, gave you some little insight. Subscribe to my channel and make sure that you tap that notification bell to know every time I post. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!